Hi guys, welcome to Angel Heart Wisdom with me, Lavinia, for your May 30th to 5th, June 2016 reading. If you're new to my channel, thank you for being here. I also want to thank you for your loyal support and your best wishes using my virtual deck as my divination tool enables me to clearly show that Spirit is here waiting to assist and provide guidance and assistance when called upon. Those of you who embrace the message and my connection with Spirit, my sincere love and gratitude to you. Continue to like, share and subscribe and show your love. For a personal reading with me, visit my website www.angelheartwisdom444.wibbly.com Book and purchase your readings. Email your questions to angelheartwisdom444 at gmail.com this week's reading layout is the past, present, and the future. Message from the soul and the decks that I'm going to be using is the Crystal Wind Oracle and the Soul's Journey Oracle. Capricorn, thank you and welcome. Hope you guys had an amazing week. It was a week where you really had to remember your past, understand your inner worth, and you could see clear signs and symbols that your problems, your trials, are dispersing you also had to really ground yourself so that you could let the white light energies run through you that way um, making your thoughts your your decision making processes a little clearer so let's see what your team has in store for you for this week ahead to assist you in navigating we have the seal this is an energy from last week um, you could clearly see um, your path uh, it was a week uh, I'm feeling like through the week of finding clarity you could clearly see where you heading where you going what you want to achieve with Sphinx like gaze the seers vision August the unknown clear seeing the wisdom of the ancients being really grounded and can really see your path um, visions, your dreams, asleep or awake. Okay, you are the seer this week. You, you're being asked to really trust your intuition and never give up. Here stands the indomitable presence of Mount Fuji. Your team is asking you to never give up because that would negate your past efforts. That would negate all the work that you have done thus far. Okay, climbing up the mountain is where you learn the lessons but coming down is where you put the lessons into practical use yeah the experience that you've gained from the climb you are able to put this into practical use so your team is asking you to never give up because you're the sage the sage upholds a symbol of sacred geometry and universal wisdom you could clearly see where you headed you've placed different things into perspective and you could clearly see the direction that your team is leading you down you're using logic over reason it is time for you to pursue knowledge you may be considering taking a course with this card the answer is yes some of you may have dreams of furthering your education going overseas travel yeah this is yes expand your training and knowledge other meanings could be you are you are about to or have just analyzed the situation and have reached a conclusion and and your team is asking you not to let the games of the mind obscure your vision okay i'm feeling like this week you could clearly see your trials are coming to an end okay you connecting with your emotions and you're going to pursue your dreams i'm feeling like answered prayers this week answered prayers um, dreams coming to fruition but you could clearly see let's go on to the soul's journey oracle for a message from the soul And we have self-worth and self-esteem and this card has been coming up for most of the signs this week there's really a call to love yourself uh understand your needs your desires what you truly want and understand 
that you are your value is being an innate creation of the universe if there was no you there would be a void that no one else could fill okay so we are all created for a particular purpose and reason and this week you being asked to clearly define yours self-esteem is your relationship with yourself and your perception of who you are and how you are doing in the world okay so how do you feel about yourself self-worth is your innate value as one of the creations of the universe your innate worth is not dependent on what you do how well you are doing how you feel about yourself or how others perceive you we are all worthy of existence we all have our own gifts and strengths that bless the world without your unique presence there is a small vacant space and that cannot be filled by anyone but you okay so understand your worth your your you raise your your perception of yourself your view of yourself raise your self-worth okay uh, spirit is saying some of us may feel unworthy at the core and your team can't do anything about that you have to clean sweep your brain and know that you are not others perception of you but your own okay so guys let me know how those messages resonate with you for the week don't forget to like share, and subscribe check out the links in the description box below for your own personal reading and like our facebook page check out our facebook page look out for our daily reveal hope to see you here soon have a beautiful week